That presents us with a screen that immediately shows us that first notice of loss so we can review the information on that document and complete the tasks necessary for the setup of the claim, choosing what branch this belongs to, who the claim rep that will be assigned to process this claim will be, and any other information that may be beneficial in the completion of this claim. So we can set information such as coverages, the claimed amount, what type of claim code it falls under, provide special instructions for the claim rep that will show up for them as comments once the, a task is launched for them. Below we have different claim status identifiers which are used to give a quick summary of the overall status of the claim which will include the type of claim and the overall status within the process. So we can mark this as a property claim so that way the claim rep can easily identify that.